Hi, wise guys. Welcome to wise guys. Rounding numbers. For rounding numbers, when we want an approximate answer rounded to a particular digit. So for example, number 5.369 you want to get the approximate answer rounded to, for example, rounded to 5. So this means to a particular digit. So how? There are two rows to follow. The first one is check the right side of your rounding digit. If that digit is 4 or less, so 4, 3, 2, or 1, drop all digits to the right of it. And rule 2 is check the right side of your rounding digit. If that digit is 5 or more than 5, so 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9, add 1 to the rounding digit and drop all the digits to the right of it. But one thing you need to be very careful, when you rounding digit, we just get the approximate answer. But you still need to keep the decimal point at the proper position. It means you never change the position of the decimal point. So later I will explain to you more. For example, rounding A35.9172 to the nearest thousands. THS, thousands. So when we have, we see the THS, it means on the right side of the decimal point, tens, hundred, thousands, which is this one. So we check on the right side of the rounding digit is two, because two less than five. So because two less than five, so drop it. So the answer is 835.917. The 7 is the rounding digit, the thousands. Because 2 less than 5, drop it. The decimal point is still here. The nearest hundreds, the THS, so on the second digit of the left side of the decimal point, which is 1. So look at the right side. The 7 is greater than 5. So because 7 is greater than 5, so we need to round up. So add 1 to the rounding digit, so which is 835.92. Round up. The nearest tenth, still THS, the first digit on the right side of the decimal point the 9, check the right side is 1. So 1 is less than 5, so drop it. The answer is 835.9. The decimal is still here. And nearest, the nearest ones, S. So on the left side of decimal point, once is the first digit here is 5. So look at the right side, the 9, 9 greater than 5. So we need to add 1 to the rounding digit, which is 836. The decimal point is still here, but not necessarily right point zero something. Right, just around 836. If rounding to tens, the nearest the tens, the tens is S. On the left side, the second digit is 3. So check on the right side of the rounding digit is 5. 5 is greater than uh, equals 5. So we still need to add 1 to the rounding digit, so which is 8, 4, because this is the decimal point over here, 
So this digit 5 is replaced by 0 because we add 1 to 3 become 4. So replace 5 with 0 in order to keep the decimal point at the proper position. Okay, so it's 840. The nearest hundreds S. Hundreds A8 because this is ones tens hundreds. So check the left side of the rounding digit is three. Three less than five. So drop it. So we got eight replaced by zero, zero, zero. So eight hundred. The nearest thousands because the thousands place is zero here. There's no number, it means zero, because 835 less than 1,000. But if we want to round, rounding the number to nearest the thousands, so we check ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. So look at the right side of the thousand digit, which is eight, greater than five, to so round up, to add one, becomes one thousand. So eight replaced by zero, but you still need to keep decimal here. Right? Because this is the original is eight. Origin this place eight thirty five. Then round up zero to round up. Add one to the thousandth place, then one and then replace 8 by 0. Okay. So now your turn. Some question to practice. Rounding for the underlying digit. Okay, after practicing, you can check your answer from our solutions. Rounding for the underlying digit. 2 on the left side of the decimal point is one's place. Check on the right side of rounding digit one is less than five. Drop it. So the answer equals 52. The second, this is on the right side, it tenth. So check on the right side. The six is greater than five. So round up. So this is equals to 9.4. Check on the right side of rounding digit 8 is greater than 5. So add 1. 0 0.08. Round number 2, 5. This is 1's uh, 10's. So check this number. This digit is greater than 5. So round up. So it becomes 6. 5 becomes 6 because 6 is greater than 5. And this 6 is replaced by 0 in order to keep the decimal point in the proper position. The decimal point is here, right? 60. On the right side of the rounding digit is 1. So less than 5, so drop it, so 82 replaced by 0, 0 and 0 because decimal point, we need to keep decimal point at the right place. After 8 is 6 greater than 5, so add 1 to the rounding digit. We got 94.239. Okay, this is presented by Wise Guy. If you still have questions, you can call our Learning Assistance Center at 204-632-2251. Thank you.